Welcome to a new series of videos here on the CWNP TV channel on IoT radio frequency channels. In the series, we'll have brief, basic coverage of the channelization used for the most common IoT protocols. And here in part one, we're going to be looking at Bluetooth. Now, Bluetooth really comes in two basic versions. There's the Bluetooth Classic and Bluetooth Low Energy, or BLE. We'll look at Classic first, which includes what is called BR, or Basic Rate, and EDR, or Enhanced Data Rate. These older Bluetooth physical layers utilize the 2.4 GHz band, just like BLE, but they have 79 channels available, channels 0 through 78. The channelization begins at the frequency of 2402 and goes all the way through 2480. The channelization is basically going to be implemented such that you take the RF channel center frequency plus K megahertz, where K is 0 through 78. So channel 0 would be 2402. Channel 1 would be 2403. Channel 2 would be 2404, and so forth. So the channelization is fairly easy in this way. Now the channels, of course, have 1 MHz spacing, and the channels are 1 MHz wide. And of course, Bluetooth uses frequency hopping across these channels, so it will develop some pattern of channels that it's going to hop across during communications. It will hop to a channel, dwell there to communicate for a while, hop to another channel, dwell there, and so forth. The key is the algorithm from the standard, 2402 megahertz is the starting point plus K megahertz, and K is 0 through 78. Now BLE, as I said, is a little different. BLE, or Bluetooth Low Energy, instead of using a 1 megahertz channel, it's going to use channels that are wider. They're going to be 2 megahertz wide. It still starts at 2402 and goes to 2480. But in the end, there are channels 2 megahertz wide instead of 1 megahertz wide. Now, in addition to that, while we have 40 channels, there are three primary advertisement channels, and then there are 37 secondary advertisement or data channels. And so it breaks the channels up differently. Now, where it gets confusing is when you see the algorithm to calculate the channel numbers, and then you see a channel map like the one that I have pictured here, you might feel that there is a conflict between the two. The frequency is used in the algorithm, just like BR and EDR. And notice it's 2402 is the starting point, plus K times 2 megahertz, where K is 0 through 39. So therefore, you would logically think that the channel that's centered on 2402 would be channel 0. Yet when we look at our graphical representation, we see channel 37. And we see that channel 0 is actually the one that, according to this algorithm, would be 2402 plus K times 2, or 1 times 2, so 2404, or channel 2404 centered would be channel 1, right? But it's listed as 0 here. So what's the difference? Well, that's what this interesting looking table at the bottom is for. PC stands for physical channel. CI stands for channel index. So physical channel 0 maps to channel index 37. Physical channel 1 maps to channel index 0, and so forth. So that's why we see 37 in the image representation, because the image is showing the channel indexes, the way we refer to those channels. But the physical channel of channel index 37 is actually channel 0 according to the algorithm. So both Bluetooth Classic and BLE operate in 2.4 GHz. Both of them use channelization algorithms to determine the channel numbers, and BLE adds the concept of the channel index.